Alright, so before this video even starts, I just want to say first of all, I had no idea how much you guys clicking on the ad would actually help me, but I was absolutely blown away. I, I think I stared at my screen for a solid five minutes. I actually couldn't believe it. So if you guys want to support me and want to support the channel and want to help fund the Brawl Pass giveaways that I do on the channel, if you see any ads on my videos now in the future, make sure to click on it, go to the website, come back to the video. It would mean so much to me. I hope you guys enjoy this guide. Make sure to like and subscribe and here we go all right so it is currently a different day if you guys didn't notice i probably sound a little bit better i recorded that intro i think at like 11 at night so i was getting ready to go to sleep but it is a different day we are back and i hope you guys are having an amazing day i did try a couple of new things on this video if you guys didn't notice the beginning or the new music or anything like that let me know what you think of all of that but yeah you guys clicked on this video because you want to get better at daryl or just because you want to support the channel but it's probably likely that you want to get better with daryl you want to push him as high as you can in Brawl Stars. But before I actually get into the video, I got a lot of DMs on Discord asking why I asked you guys in the last video to click on the ad. And if you guys don't know, I do get paid from YouTube and I don't worry about it too much. I do YouTube for fun. I love making videos to entertain everybody but when you see ads and when you skip it or when you see an ad and nobody clicks on it i actually get nothing from it so that is the main reason why i ask everyone to click on it because i actually get something out of it so those of you who did and those of you who want to it really helps me it really supports me but i'm gonna stop talking now and get into this game all right so daryl daryl is actually one of the best showdown brawlers and i think he's been one of the best showdown brawlers honestly i would say since the game has been around i would recommend pushing him in solo showdown you can push him in duo you can push him in 3v3 like a brawl ball or any other 3v3 mode but uh, i would just say because he's a tank and because of where the meta is right now uh daryl counters a lot of brawlers i would just say playing him on any maps that have no super long range where he won't be able to do anything for example he gets countered by b he gets countered by tara he gets countered by anyone who can deal a lot of damage and who has a lot of defense so b for example can do really well into daryl i'm going up against an edgar here and an invisible leon who's going for me i don't know why he went for me i'm able to kill the edgar let's see if i can win this game i think i should be able to if i can juke the leon Okay, I th okay, we juke that shot. I should be able to kill him right here. And okay, we kill him. That's going to be the first game. And let's hop into game number two. All right, getting into the next game. By the way, guys, let me know which uh, rank 30 guide you would like to see next. I see a lot of comments about Shelly. And I'm not really sure if I want to make a Shelly guide because Shelly, in my opinion, is a really easy brawler to push in showdown. But I don't think a lot of people actually know how to push her. So let me know if you want me to do that or any other brawler. But yeah, I'm pretty sure I just saw two Mortises, Mordai, whatever you want to call it. So that's pretty weird. Two Mortises with the same skin. This Poco thinks we're teaming. By the way, I, I try to do all of these games without teaming. Uh, even though teaming is a really useful strategy to use. Uh, I think I pushed a lot of rank 30s using teaming, but it's not its not like the most impressive thing when you say, I got a rank 30 with teaming, so I do a lot of these games, I think, uh, without teaming, so I'm just going to go for everybody. I might like not shoot someone, but I'm definitely just not going to spin, uh, and if I don't shoot them, then I'm just going to backstab them later when I get the opportunity to. I think a big thing people don't actually understand with Daryl is he's a brawler that you have to be really aggressive with, so I'm going to go in on this Poco right now, or not right now, but okay, yeah, we're just going to go in, actually, that was a really good opportunity, but like I was saying, a lot of people don't understand and that Daryl is a brawler you need to be very aggressive with because of how easily he gets his super. For example, uh, his super recharges without actually doing anything. So even if you go in, if you even if you go in on a brawler and uh, don't kill them, you'll get your super back very very quickly because it recharges. And when you actually go in for that brawler, you'll have a high chance of dealing damage to them, which will also give you charge for your super. All right, so now I'll talk about why you should be playing Daryl. And I just think because the last couple of years in Brawl Stars, the meta has been so tank reliant. So there's basically what I mean is he has a very high damage output and if you guys don't know he has very very high health and really good burst and mobility and if you guys don't know I think I already said it though he does have a self-charging super 
So basically, that means you can play really passive or really aggressive. And like I was saying earlier, he's good in a lot of game modes. And uh, if you were ch choosing to play him in 3v3, he's a really good team brawler to have. But on the other hand, if you do choose to play him in solo showdown like I'm doing here, he also works with not a lot of power cubes. So if you guys don't know, there's some brawlers that you, when you push in solo showdown, you're going to need a lot of power cubes. For example, like Penny is not a very good brawler, but you could probably get away with it if you had like 10 power cubes or something. Alright, so it looks like this Daryl is going to be giving us the win, so let's hop into game number three. Currently a different day, and we have a different map. There's two cubes here. I'm probably going to go for them. I don't think there's too much of a risk in doing so. The only thing for this map, I would say, is probably uh, there's a bush in the bottom left or bottom middle. I can show you over here. I'll just shoot it. There's a bush right here, that big bush right there that a lot of people actually camp in. And it usually catches a lot of people off guard, so make sure you check this bush, even though I'm not going to check it, we're just going to run straight in, because I know no one's going to be in there at the very start of the game. But okay, this buzz has five cubes, hopefully we can kill him. I think I'm actually going to roll on him and hopefully get the skill, which we do, perfect. And Leon is kind of being annoying. I don't know why he's still shooting me, I have five cubes, if I get my super, I think I could absolutely destroy him, but... Hopefully he doesn't do anything crazy. We're actually getting really low and I think there's another Leon inside of the bush above us. Alright guys, so unfortunately the audio for the rest of the video was cut out. I think I lost the files for it and I accidentally deleted it. So I could do a voiceover but it's not going to be the same because I think it's better when I do it live when I'm playing. So the first six and a half minutes or so of this video was live but I'm not going to do a voiceover. But if you guys do want to support me, make sure to watch this to the end. I'm just going to have this calm music. I think I get a win in every single game here so if you want to support me if you want to help this video get sent out to more people make sure to watch this video to the end there's gonna be some cool music like i said if you see any ads make sure to click on it, it helps me so much if you do you're an absolute legend and i hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video